truck down is about um, 349 my time. A lot of y'all know me as Reno in slow motion. Yup. <clears throat> Just up on here making a quick video. And um, the video in the title is um, Closeted. No, Country Closeted. And the reason why I'm making it that is because there are so many people that live in the country that feel like they gotta hide who they are. I mean, have you ever been to Wisconsin, Mexico, um, Nebraska, Arizona, Alabama, Montana, Idaho, Indiana, stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Living in an area that you feel like you can't be you. And then, it's not even that. A lot of people know of you. Um, now where I'm staying at, the reason why I made this video is because I see a lot of clothing women and men that cannot express who they are in small towns. And I just don't understand that. If you can do it in a city, you can do it in a small town. Regardless, you might have less population. You might not have that many friends after me, after you come out the closet. But you know, at the end of the day, the great part about that is you can pick up and walk to the left, walk to the right. It don't matter. Um, I met a lot of people tonight. That are very closeted, um, not opinionated, free spirit, free expression, and I like that about them. I like that about them. Hold on one second. Hello. Hi. Uh, nothing. been missing me huh What you ready for? It depends on what you ready for. I'm thinking about you. What am I ready for? And you thinking of me? What you thinking about me? You hear that, right? Y'all heard that, right? I don't know if we caught any of it. I don't even remember giving this chick my number. But me being in a small town, there's so many closeted people. I'm ignored because she just off the chain. And she gonna call me back because she drunk and feeling good by herself. But what I'm saying is, there's so many people with that live that live in these small towns and everything that want someone to jump them out their closet. You feel me? I, I just be amazed. I just moved here and I already have 
crazy broads calling me already. You know what I'm saying? I'm not even from here. And it's it's ridiculous. It's like a shocking. Like men that claim to be so hardcore. Walk around. Be so feminine later. I was like, what? Are you for real? Okay, look here. Just because you're in a small town, females and males, doesn't mean you have to hide your sexuality. And don't try to betray it just because you see a new face in your facility or your area or your county, state, whatever. You see how she's blowing up my phone, right? I'm putting her on private, right? She won't call me back. <laughs> and that's how I go. <laughs> it's crazy. And I just and I just met her. And I just met her tonight. Already blowing up my phone. Like a crazy girl. Um a lot of the ones that be talking about they so hardcore, be lying about themselves and the women that say they and there's a lot of confused women in small towns. Like, they say they're straight. The minute they see a dominant or a gay-looking type of person, or me being FTM or trans, then they come out the closet, just sprout their wings and fly the fuck out the closet. The hell? You gonna fly your ass back in the closet? You wouldn't try to come out the closet before you met me, or when you see me, why are you gonna come out now? My thing is, it's too many people trying to betray themselves as someone else, and it takes too much time and too much issues and too much emotion than to be yourself. So, be that yourself. Because people will respect you, no matter where you live at. No matter if you live in Ohio, Atlanta, Texas, Colorado, wherever. People will respect you. I'm just making this out. That closeted countries should not be closeted. You shouldn't feel like you have to be closeted for being who you are. But you know what this is. It's Mayor Kumari just telling you the realistic that what they say about small towns is overrated. It's beyond that. You hear me? Alright?